someone there? <laughs> we've got ghosts in the house. Sorry, we've just, someone's broken into the house. Let me just go and check. No, 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 don't. Hello? <laughs> no, no, don't worry, let them take the TV. <laughs> Hello there. Check it out. We're back. The both of us. We're becoming the internet's number one DJing husband and wife mm. duo. Okay, number no. three. Yeah. We're, 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 in the, we're, we're nicely in the top ten. We're nicely in the top ten husband and wife DJ duo. In we'll just agree on that, okay? <laughs> so, why is Em back? Why? Well, the answer is because... I'm teaching him how to become a superstar DJ at the moment. And every now and again, I'm teaching her something. I'm like, why aren't we teaching this in front of the camera? Mm -hmm. And you don't know the answer to that question. No. So we said, chuck the camera on. And then, you know, you can have a little insight into our lives. So today I'm teaching Em a DJ transition where basically we got one track, this one over here, that sounds a bit like this. So that's the drop, and we've got a vocal over here that's this one that goes, it's the hard drive deep inside. You all, you all know this one. So what we're going to do is we're going to have that building to this drop, but we're going to do it in a kind of musical way, okay? So I'm going to just straight up show you and you guys what it's going to sound like. Probably going to mess it up myself now with the pressure of all this. Come on. Oh, yeah. That's it, that's the one. Hey! All right, okay. Um, so first things first, we just got both the tracks on 126 BPM, okay? And uh, we're gonna, we're gonna actually- Remember you're teaching me. Yeah, I'm teaching you. So we're actually gonna, um, we're actually gonna like drum a bit of a pattern in that kind of goes. Okay, so we're gonna, we're introducing it with a bit of a pattern. Okay. Okay. So yeah. you've got to get this right, you've got to be able to hit that final thing at the point you want it to bring in. So we've already kind of set our cue point so we know. So actually we haven't set a cue point, so let me just no, show you this, okay? Yeah. On that phrase there, okay? On that phrase there, do we want to start the DVD yeah, so or want... do we want it to be full on in? Exactly that, so at this exact phrase point, by the way guys, if you want to know all about phrases and you want to see how M got up to this point, she we just recently did a course together, link below in the description. Um, but look, this is it. So we've got this phrase just at the end of the intro drums where it goes, Oh, they told me how to love this bit here. Yeah. Okay. But my question still stands. Which is what? <laughs> <laughs> What's your question? Do you want, is it the bit where you go... Or, uh, no, the, the final, the final we're in yeah, happens. Fine. So okay, like, fine. essentially it. it would be this, okay? Now, before we go any further, there's a couple of other things going on here already, which I haven't told you about. We've got a bit of reverb on this vocal here, because without it, it sounds very dry. So I'm going to turn the reverb off. You can see that's pointing at number three, which is this lane here. Yeah. Now, without it, it sounds like this. <laughs> which is okay. Yeah, exactly. It's like very, like, in your face. Whereas a bit of reverb, but it's actually a bit more like, ooh, like this. Yeah. And yeah. you pause it, it's like, it's almost like it merges in a bit better. Yeah. So, essentially, what we're going to do, in fact, let me just show you the whole transition. I said I was going to show you the whole transition, I haven't done it. So this is it. Do it. See, I've already messed up myself. Here's another big thing, okay? There's actually vocals on this track over here, which go, we told me not to love, right? Yeah. And we've got vocals over here. Now, a golden rule of thumb, or you general want, rule. You don't want vocals on vocals. Nah, you just don't. So what you can do is you can kind of cut these vocals out by filtering this song down. So when it actually comes in, we're going to filter this track right down. Yeah. Which you can imagine in a club actually builds a lot of suspense and it allows this vocal to sit on top of it nicely, like this. Yeah. And you're bringing it up. Yeah. Quick question. 
question. Yeah. Why wouldn't you just take the mids out of that one to get the vocals off? You could do, but actually it's going to be a lot easier to just filter in over time okay, rather fine. than like fiddling around yeah, yeah, with yeah. that, okay? Because we're actually going to do more stuff to this vocal. Like we're going to speed this up and double the speed and stuff. Right. So as soon as we've brought that vocal in, we're filtering this down and we're, br we're filtering it down massively, like literally right down to this point here. Right, yeah. So not completely uh, off, but not basically off, but all the like, way down. It's basically, you, you bringing it down to nothing and yeah. then you're slowly filtering it in over time. It has two jobs, it builds more tension yeah. and it also gets rid of the vocals that's clashing with this. So this can sit there nicely all reverby yeah. and then you're bringing this up over time. Yeah. And then at a certain point we're going to double the speed of this, okay? Go so ahead. I'm just going to, again, the longest intro ever but I'm actually just going to show you what it should look like. <laughs> and the only reason is because I messed up. Okay, here we go. So let's just check everything's all good. Here we go. There's a lot going on there, half yeah. of which we've already kind of explained, which is we're filtering this song down. Yeah. We then at some point want to actually put a loop on this. It goes deep, deep, deep. And then we do that classic thing of speeding it yeah. up on every kind of four bars. Which yeah. Don't so worry too much about the bars. It's just like a feeling at this point. It's like, yeah, Bill, now's a good time to build. And you'll kind of feel, you'll know when yeah. to do it. Now here's another tricky thing. At the beginning we we're going deep, 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 deep. You need quantize off. Because you want it to hit whenever you hit it. Yeah. It's not making yeah. a sound. Yeah. If you put quantize on, it will try and snap it to a grid, which yeah. won't give you that kind of flow. Yeah. It, it sounds like I'm messing up, but it's not. It's just the thing snapping it to a grid. Okay. So, Could this is everything. Yeah, so this is everything. You start with it quantized off. Yeah. You bring it in. You did, 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 phrase. Yeah. Okay, so then it starts to build. Then quantize on. Yeah, okay. and you've got to get it. Then you're going to like it. beat match it yeah. up so it's lined up. Yeah. Then at a certain point, which you'll probably actually see because you'll probably notice, you can kind of see where my loop was before here on the screen. I'll copy that. So you just kind of copy that, but you'll, you'll know when to do it. You kind of get the vibe because it's kind of like a go with the flow type thing, this. Yeah. And then you put quantize on, so when everything's going well, you put it on. At this point, in, out. And then so you, you put just... quantize on before you do your loop. Yeah. Yeah. And then at this point here, you go in, out, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. you half it. You already know how to do a lot of this stuff, so it just speeds up and speeds yeah. up. So, so you're this. halving it on phrase, quartering it on phrase, and then is that and the minimum? Then there's one last thing. So we build it up like this. Beep, 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 and then just before the drop hits, we want it to go deep, deep inside, drop. Yeah, you want to so go. So Boom. you prep, so you press, yeah, the, the yeah, cue so it's, again. It's a lot to remember here. It's ridiculous. So I'm going to suggest we do this. Before we do the finger drumming, let's just get everything else done first. So on phrase, I want you to just bring it in, put, leave it on quantize, put that in, speed it up and double it and double it over time. Yeah. And then at the last second, which you'll know because you'll look at this deck here, at this point here, just before the drop, here it goes. Deep inside, deep. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. So we're going to give this a go. It's probably my worst explanation ever. So all we're going to start with is this track over here. On phrase, just bring that in. Just hit A and it'll come in, okay? Because the big difference with these decks, which you'll probably know by now, to the DDJ 400s, you hit a cue point and it just comes in. Like, yeah. It's not, like, like, yeah, it's not yeah. like a gate where you hold it and take it and off. And that's cued, is it? This yeah, one? this is all cued. Okay, let's give this a go. Tons of information. You just gotta practice it, you know? Okay, right, here we go. Hey. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I'll let you do it. I'll, I'll let you do it. Hands off, Don't mate. Don't want to rush you. Don't want to rush you. <laughs> You didn't, did, filter, you didn't uh, filter up on that, no. and I don't know what happened, but somehow it was just in time at the end. I know. Um, so try it one more time, but Basically, this time... Basically, I fluked that one. But I think you kind of were. Right, so we're going to do it one last time, and this time just kind of filter up, and remember to filter up on this one as well, so it's kind of going... Oh, like that. Okay, but remember you've got to put it back in order to do that. Okay, so there we go. Hopefully you guys have learned something from this as well. Um, it's tricky. The main big takeaway for you on this one is this tapping. You've got to have quantize off and you just got to practice it. And come up with your own rhythms, like... Yeah. Right? No, it's just... I was just riffing then. I felt like, um, I felt like, um, what's that guy on the guitar? The guy from Guns N' Roses. Oh, it's gone. Joke's gone. What's Joke's his name? Slade or something. Oh, that's... I don't, oh, I don't know. know. I, I felt like a famous guitarist. Okay. Right. Let's go. So I'm going again. Yeah. Just at the last minute, you didn't bring deep down inside yeah, and at the right point, just, yeah. it was delayed. It kind of worked while you're skin of your teeth. Do you I want to do it one? I need to practice. You just need to practice, but that's it. But We're I tell not... you, we'll we'll do like a little video on the Instagram or something, shall we? Yeah. And then, and then that'll, yeah. Be, that'll be the real deal. Yeah, yeah. So if you <laughs> want to see Em's final like real <laughs> practice performance of that, go and follow me, at Phil Harris Music. We're not really letting them follow you, are you? Yours is more like a family kind of thing. You want to see lots of MDJ, you got to follow me on Instagram. And I do weekly, no, monthly giveaways. So I give away like my DJ courses and DJ decks. Mm. So if you want any of that, you got to go and check it out. And final thoughts for them all? Um, it's a lot to... It's a lot finger to... drumming. Just practice your finger drumming. Yeah, you... Well... No, I'm not going to say that, but basically, yeah, that's all you've got to well, do. Well, that is what that, that's what you call it. It is that. finger drumming, yeah, that's exactly it. Um, and it's it's a lot to remember, but it's it's very core things going on here. You don't want clashing frequencies, so we brought the filter down. Mm. We want to build tension, so we double the speed over here, it builds tension. We bring the filter up, that builds more tension as well. We don't want to just end on it with going so we can bring in the loop or the, the hook one more time before the drop hits. But you want to get rid of it so it's not playing over the mm. drop. There's lots of like advanced stuff going on here. You know, like take the quantos off so you can finger drum, put the quantos on so you can loop. Yeah. It's difficult, but it is just muscle memory. Yeah. You know, and you know, think James Hype here. All this really technical stuff. It's just muscle memory for him at this point because he's done these little routines so many times. And it's just basically that, you know. Yeah. So, there we go. See ya. Anything else you want to say? Oh, you want to see another video with DJ M? We're not calling you DJ M, are no. we? We're calling you Emily. If well, you want to see... Yeah. Wait, wait, yeah. You go with whatever you Click want this go. video here and see <laughs> another video with Emily in. See you next time. Ciao. <laughs>